First, we begin with a consumer alert. Bluebell is recalling all of its products because of listeria fears. That's right. The news is hard to hear for residents of Brenham, where Bluebell is made. Channel 2's Brandon Walker joining us now live from Brenham with how people there are reacting. Brandon, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Andy. Talk about the talk of the town. One woman told me that this hurts them because they take Bluebell so seriously. It's part of their community here. The company has been conducting its own tests of Bluebell ice cream since Listeria first showed up in their product last month. And yesterday, they got the results of testing done for a product made here in Brenham, and the results didn't look good. In the city of Brenham, all roads lead to one place. What does Bluebell mean to Brenham? It is Brenham. Tootsie Fisher runs Tootsie Check Cashing Service just inside Felder's Buy and Buy, a convenience store. Here, Bluebell runs deep. Everybody stops by and get an ice cream here, there, just a snack. It's so popular the freezer greets customers at the door. This morning it's full, but none of it can be sold. Withdrew all those products. Joe Robertson is a spokesman for Bluebell. Yesterday, the company issued a voluntary recall of all its products amid listeria contamination. Stores pulled it from freezers, giving the company time to pinpoint the source of the outbreak. Uh, we have a team of experts in all of our facilities. The FDA and uh, local health officials are in all four of our facilities. Robertson says it will take two to three weeks before Bluebell begins to pull their recall. The creamery employs 3,800 people, 900 in Brenham alone. For now, jobs are safe. We've assured them that they're employed. I'm pretty sure everything's going to work out all right. So far, many in Brenham say Bluebell is doing the right thing. Tootsie Fisher sure thinks so. They're pulling it off voluntarily. No one's making them do it. And um, they're going to fix the problem. And back here live, that recall covers the 23 states in which Bluebell is sold, of course, including the state of Texas, also international posts. Reporting live this morning from Brenham, I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC Channel 2 News. Brandon, thank you. We'll stay with KPRC Channel 2 for continuing coverage of the Bluebell recall. Coming up at 1130, consumer expert Amy Davis will answer your questions about what to do with what's in your freezer.